Welcome back to the Mountain Morning Show. Very happy to have Kelly Buskirk here and the paint mixer. Hello. Hello. It's great to have you. Thanks for having me. You're, you're an artist. Uh, I'll call you the artist in, resi in residence. Does that work? That works. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> this, I'm really excited to talk to you today because I see things I like here. There's uh, some, some skate decks and uh, certainly some great uh, holiday paintings behind us. This is really cool, but you're you're a little tired. Yes, you're a little, a little tired. Bit, can, we, late can we get a little, get a little <laughs> energy out of you? You have a reason for it, though, uh, and that's because you guys were out at a party for City Weekly. Yes, yeah, we won uh, two awards for City Weekly. We won the third best date night in all of Utah. Wow. And the first um, best paint and wine bar in the state. So that's awesome. Definitely really excited about both of those awards. I did not know there was so much competition in the paint and wine bar area, of course, but you're the ones that, all, that started it all, so it should Yep. be surprising everybody else wants to do it but there's a lot of them yeah there are there's um you know they're popping up all over the country but um in utah there's probably about six right now but we were the first and definitely excited to take the award yeah to be the best yes well that's pretty neat that's for sure and uh, i've got to say out of all the different things you could do on a date yeah top fun. top three that's yeah. pretty ridiculous yep we've had actually some engagements that started from the paint mixer so oh, yeah? pretty excited about that so yeah. in other words it works it works yeah <laughs> give good. it a try over the holidays <laughs> that's awesome yep. well i uh i love uh, the fact that in the summertime you guys do a whole lot of camps for kids yes and you yep. get the kids engaged in painting and that we know that if you're going to be a painter when you're old you've got to be able to be a painter now. when you're kid yeah <laughs> yep. or just not going to happen typically you get like me and you're like very self-conscious <laughs> i don't want anybody to see any of my stuff uh and and that's something that you got to get over early yeah so it shouldn't be a big surprise just that you figured out uh, some things that kids like to paint on yeah exactly <laughs> especially in park city you know salt lake area um we started the three-day uh paint a skateboard workshop brought some examples to show I like this one a lot yep. yeah this is great um, but basically we just kind of uh, teach kids that really anything can be art and we um, using a skateboard get their, their interest there um, it's three days long and we take them start to finish um, teach them a lot about graphic design um, just really different elements of, of media um, so yeah these examples here I love these over here yeah especially <laughs> I'm so pretty is they're really fun I'm gonna I'm just gonna tilt that up a little bit so we can get make sure we get a good shot of it here yeah <laughs> that is so awesome yeah so basically um we uh we walk them around on main street to a couple galleries um you know get get an interest in what they want to do um and then we sketch them uh the first day is all sketching out their artwork onto the actual skate okay. deck which we supply in the camp um and then second day obviously uh painting that third day and last day is more of the detail work um, That's cool. but at the end they can either hang it up on their wall or they can actually um, put a grip uh, grip tape excuse me grip tape on the top and wheels as well it. and actually skate it so it's yeah, really cool. That's what you gotta do right? I yeah. mean it, if it's something you love it's got to get a little dirty Exactly. Right, so that only makes sense. <laughs> and, you know, you can always go back and touch it up, right? If you know yeah. what you're doing, it's your painting. Yeah. You can always fix it if you need to. But wow. We, we do prime it as well. So we put a nice coat on there and finish it. So it's not going to, I mean, depends what they're doing. But uh, if you hang it on your wall and it's going to be preserved for for some time. That's awesome. What yeah. a terrific idea. I mean, I, I would have killed to do this when I was a kid. <laughs> this is kind of the ultimate, really. I, yeah, and I guess you could do if you wanted to. Uh, now, this side's finished. This comes finished, right? Because yep. you're going to put the grip tape yep, on here. Yeah, you're going to put the so grip tape on yeah, there. Yeah, you can only do the back. Okay, yeah. that makes sense. So but some people that would like look to look good on up. a wall. Yeah. 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 Actually, in a lot of the local businesses around, you'll see that um, artists, it's kind of a new thing to do, is design a skate deck. Um, but yeah, we're also partnered yep. with the, the university to do the kids camp in Salt Lake and Park City School District on the camps up here. You know, the other one I see a lot, and you guys were one of the first ones I ever saw it with too, was the painting of bottles and different things. Yeah. And that's become a lot bigger yeah, ever yeah. since, which it's is amazing. Great gift idea as well for right? the holidays. Yep. So speaking of holidays, we've got some great holiday artwork as well behind us. I'm yes. just going to bring this one up right here because it's just <laughs> very colorful. Yeah, that one's called our Sassy Christmas, and that's going to be a popular hit. Uh, owls are really trendy right now. Yeah, what is the deal? <laughs> owls are like a big deal. They, yeah. They're, well, it's, you know, I mean, they're cool, and they can turn their neck around a long ways, right? Yep. Their head. I, I can see why they're popular, but yep. they're super popular right now. Yeah. I like this. This is uh, this is a beautiful one. It's yeah. kind of starry night, but fireworks. It's yeah. great. That one's called our Mountain Celebration, and that's yeah. going to be popular around the New Year, obviously. 
Oh, I'll bet. And then this one. That's beautiful. Yeah, I'm really liking this one. I'm a snowboarder myself, so I think this is going to be popular up here, especially over the holidays. You yeah. know. New uh, gondola taking you from one resort to another, kind <laughs> exactly. of uh, esque. Exactly. I feel that one. <laughs> I'm going to bring this in. It's nice snowman right here. Now these look. I got to be honest. This is, looks a little more detailed than what I've seen before and it worries me a little bit. I'm not real good. <laughs> Can anybody paint this? Yeah, definitely. I mean, it's acrylic paint. We just start from uh, step by step. So this one, you just start with the background black and then work your way forward. Um, I always okay. think of it as a smaller brush as you work your way forward in the layers. But that one's actually fairly easy, actually. Really? Yep. <laughs> yeah. I'm surprised. There's like some three-dimensional stuff going on. I'm like, I don't know. <laughs> yep, no, but that one's a simple one. <laughs> I got to be honest. I, I've, I've had only one experience painting with you guys, and that was here on set. And I felt pretty good about it. Mm -hmm. For yeah. yeah. I mean, it looked... It looked like yours, I yeah, think. Yeah, exactly. But that's the, the, there's a method here, mm -hmm. right? And that's yeah. uh, what you were kind of describing there. That yes. in this one, it was it's coming forward with smaller brushes. Yeah. There's other methods that are going to be used, and those methods are what make it possible for everybody to do this. Yeah, yeah. So it's really there is no experience necessary for any of our paintings, and all of our artists, our staff is really trained to break it down simple, step by step. So it really does not matter if you have no experience. It's all about you know coming in, having a great time with your friends, family, and at the end and having a piece of work that you're proud of. Okay, well you mentioned something we should talk about there. Friends and family, date nights, Night. uh, you get kids camps and, 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 and you know, uh, other uh, you know, events for kids. Uh, but also, you've got a lot of uh, folks with like Christmas parties yeah, coming yeah. to you. And, and I'm amazed you, you even have time to do anything else. Yeah. It sounds <laughs> like some of these big companies are like booking you up for like a full day. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, Christmas time is definitely um, our busiest time of the season. Um, family parties, company parties. Um, it's really a great way for everyone to come in and just, you know, don't think about work for a while, have a great time together, have a glass of wine. We um, also will partner with caterers as well. Yeah. Um, sometimes we park the food trucks right outside. Oh, I like that yeah. idea. So it's really yeah. fun, um, just kind of spice it up a little bit. And whatever you want to do, we can basically um, customize the party to your needs. But Christmas time is definitely our busy time. Um, we're still you know, taking um, reservations for any party, um, family parties, company parties, it's a blast. I'll say. So any size limitations here? It sounds like you can pretty much, yeah. depending on how much time you put to it, you can bring in just about any size company, it sounds yeah, like. Yeah, definitely. Um, so our Salt Lake studio holds up to about 45 people. Okay. Um, Park City is a little bit larger, holds up to 60. Wow. Um, but that being said, we'll go off site. So um, we've done events, you know, on the side of the mountain. Um, we take our stuff up the gondola at the canyons really? we did. That's a couple of years ago. So um, we'll go anywhere. We have done uh, corporate events at the Grand America downtown for uh, <laughs> groups as large as 250 people. Serious? Yeah, so we have the equipment, we'll come to you, we'll set it all up, and you guys will be taken care of. So, wow, yeah. how, do you keep, how do you keep that many people painting together? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> you better have a lot of painters with you. We did. That one we had five artists actually walking around on the floor. So yeah, you would need it. Yep. That is cool though. Yeah, it's cool. Wow. I mean, did you, I mean, can you imagine, I mean, the collage of that many paintings together, did you kind yeah. of put them all together and get a picture? We did. I think we had a group photo at the end. It was pretty impressive. <laughs> I'll <laughs> so. say. Wow. Well, yeah. I, I just want to share one more here. This one is terrific, too. So what is this one called? That one is one of our, uh, that one's Winter Wonderland. Winter Wonderland. Yep. Oh, I love it's it. It's one of our new Beautiful. ones. Beautiful. Some great color there. Yep. You don't, you know, it's kind of, I always think a challenge to catch the color of Utah's sky mm -hmm. because it is it different than you'll see time. anywhere else and it's different. Yeah, it changes a lot. Yep. Wow, these are just terrific. Yeah. Well, the paint mixer, clearly a, a great choice for date night. We know that. Yeah. Top three. Yeah. That's awesome, mm -hmm. yeah. uh, for sure. Christmas parties. Mm -hmm. Oh, my gosh. I'd be, they're already almost booked out. That's pretty cool. And yeah. then, of course, you've got every other way of doing it with your friends, your family. Mm -hmm. I think family, that's a good one. Yeah. Yeah. That's awesome. You work out <laughs> some family dynamics of, over paint. That's a, that's a great idea. Thank you so much for sharing all this with us. Yeah. This is terrific. That's so, great. Uh, locations? Um, right on Main Street in Park City okay. um, by Atticus Coffee Shop. Um, and then in Salt Lake, right next to the Dodo and Sugar House Park. So right off the freeway. Okay. Yeah. So, uh, of course, you can go online, uh, both the website and on Facebook, right? Yep, we're on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, all that. All right, let's get working on this one, okay?
okay? okay. We'll take a commercial <laughs> break. I'm going to start painting, and uh, we've got a lot more coming up here on the Mountain Morning Show. We're going to take a break, uh, pay some bills. We'll be right back after this. Mm -hmm.